What is up everybody, welcome to the channel once again and today I'm actually waiting on a delivery that was supposed to come yesterday and now it caught up to another delivery and this is some Turkish cargo company and uh, this lad right here is just chilling in one spot the cargo you supposed to be, the package that I was supposed to get was supposed to be here yesterday and he's just in some random location sitting there for god knows how long and it happened yesterday as well like, come on, dude. How, how can I get up to you? <sighs> Anyways, we need to pick up this package. Then we need to go to another place to pick up another package. But to pick up another package, this lad has to actually come up to me. And there's no way to contact him. This is very annoying. Anyways, I'm going to try my best to utilize this time for the better. This is a daily vlog. We're going to be making daily videos just like we used to back in Russia. Hopefully you're going to be enjoying that. And if you do enjoy, you might as well subscribe and check out the buy me a coffee link if you want to support the cause. You know what? The time is only adding up to this lad over here. So there is a live update of where he's located. So let's go and try and find this truck right here. Hopefully find him take our package and have the day to us because it's 2.33 p.m. and I was still not able to get out of the house just because this lad is just probably eating a few kebabs for God knows how long. So anyways, let's go and find the guy, collect our package, go to another postal office, get another package and get ourselves sorted out. This is really annoying, so let's go. Oh, it's a bit chilly, but anyways, first things first, when you leave the apartment, you gotta take out the trash. What the heck is that on my car? What is this? Oh, well, I do not need a sofa at all. Who needs a sofa? This car definitely needs a wash. But it's gonna be raining soon, so it's too early to give my car a wash. Well, let's go find this delivery guy somewhere. Or maybe let's go to the post office where there's a package waiting for us and maybe the guy's gonna go here. You never know, you never know. So let's see how the day goes today. Ooh, that sound is bright and amazing. So guys, I finally got to the cargo place. Ooh, let's go collect our stuff in Surat Cargo. <laughs> okay, I'm absolutely confused. So the thing I came for here was actually left over by the door yesterday, which was the house for the cat. Now I'm really confused on what the heck am I supposed to collect? Anyways, let's try to find that delivery guy one way or another and collect something at least. So we're on the hunt for the delivery guy because apparently there's like a live update of where he's located right now and I just typed in the street where he's at in my navigator. So let's go and try to find him right here really quickly. Because that guy didn't deliver what he was supposed to yesterday and by the uh, the by the time not going down with this delivery I doubt he's gonna get it delivered like two packages get delivered today so we better catch up to him if you want something done better do it yourself let's overtake this Range Rover right here so I gave up on the delivery guy because that program is just it's broken it doesn't show his real location anywhere I go it feels like he's teleporting or something like that so anyways we're gonna go to the center we're gonna walk around and just enjoy the evening because like chasing after this guy is literally impossible because the website is broken the delivery guy is just not delivering I don't know what is going on anyways um, yeah this sucks so we made it to <laughs> God damn, what are you doing? <laughs> Anyways, we made it to the city center right now. Still haven't got a call from the guy who was supposed to deliver the things and I doubt that he'll actually deliver anything today for some reason. Anyways, this place is beautiful. It's actually really hot right now. I don't know why I'm wearing a jacket, but uh, it's gonna get chilly quite soon. But as you can see, 
Turkish delights everywhere. The weather is beautiful. People walking around the place and waterfall. Now that's not sponsored. Do not buy waterfall. Buy Ivan cell provider, whatever. Anyways, this is the place. Oh guys, Evelina wants to go into a store. It's called Boutique D. I fell into this trap once again, guys. Anyways, we're coming in. Surprisingly, we weren't that long in that store, so uh, I feel like a free man once again. Anyway, surprisingly, there's a lot of people walking around the place, but I don't blame them. It's a beautiful day outside. So I actually bought myself a few t-shirts because um, I actually only had like three or four that I actually wore. So now the best part of the day is we're gonna go to Starbucks and get myself my favorite drink, which I found recently, which is the Starbucks Acai or Acai. I don't even know how to pronounce it right. You might as well correct me in the comment section below. But uh, we're trying to jaywalk here. are always crazy over at this place. God damn, people, some people just want to skip like all the time the flat back here. Look at him, all embarrassed now. Anyways, I need to get my strawberry refresher, get my girlfriend a cake with nuts. But this queue is mad. This is battle for strawberry actually refresher. Can't believe the Starbucks didn't have an or Flipping strawberry actually refresher. Anyways, got myself a coffee instead. Got Evelina a mango and orange refresher. God damn, fix the Starbucks. Where's the strawberry actually refresher? What am I paying for? Now I have to drink an extra shot of cappuccino right here. Oh, that kid went bananas for some reason. But uh, look at Evelina, look how beautiful she looks like. Damn, look at this girl, damn. Good, good. Anyways, I have no idea what we're gonna be doing after that cup of coffee at Starbucks, which I didn't really enjoy. I mean, coffee at Starbucks isn't as good as the strawberry actually refreshing. Oh, and I forgot, I need to figure out how to take out money to pay my rent, because I need to pay my rent in one day, basically. So we're gonna drive down and uh, see how we could do it through crypto to exchange it into dollars then change it into euros because the landlord wants the payment in euros i don't know why i prefer dollars dollars is just way easier but then i have to exchange euros into dollars so annoying oh no i need to go into a store with evelina again no okay well i guess i have no choice oh look at this cat right here so because me and the cats were farting way too much in the house, we're gonna get one of those things. It's only like 100 liters. It's gonna make the apartment smell nice. It's gonna mix, it's, it's a reed diffuser. It's gonna mix with my farts and the cat's farts. So that's gonna be a nice stench to the building. Guys, what I love Turkey for is check out this Mercedes Benz right here. Look at this Benzo. Damn boys, look at those ribs. This is one stylish Mercedes for sure. I actually have it in one of my videos, but check this out. Damn. It stands a little bit. This is very nice. Look at the steering wheel as well. Cool. I would actually like one of those Mercedes because those Mercedes looks cool on those rims. It's a real gangster car. I just lost Evelina. Where the heck is Evelina? Where is she? Cannot find her. Maybe she's in the store. Oh, I guess I'm a single man now. Where's the woman at? Where's the women at? Well, I guess I'm not a single man because Evelina just ran away from me and she found a little kitty by the looks of it. Let's check it out. Look, she found a little baby. Look at her. Oh my God. <laughs> little tiny kitty god who just doesn't love cats cats are the best look it's chilling on her finger well now the cat thinks that uh, evelina is a mama cat look at it 
just climbed by herself. <laughs> so I've done the maths. I've actually went to an exchange office <clears throat> where they take cryptos like down there. And um, it wasn't it wasn't worth it um, because I could actually save money by doing it through Golden Corona. It's called Corona Golden or something like that. Anyways, it's it's way better for me to convert the money that way to pay for the rent. So tomorrow we're gonna go to the post office and um, get us some money to pay for the rent. Anyways, I also got a notification from the delivery service that my packages have actually arrived. So I'm guessing they just dropped them off uh, to my door, finally. Hopefully they got everything that we actually ordered. There should be two things there. If there's only one, oh, they're, they're gonna be in trouble, guys. They're definitely gonna be in trouble. Now, we haven't eaten since the morning, so right now we're gonna see if uh, one of my friends also wants to go out for dinner and um, we will find somewhere to eat. Anyways, let's see how that goes. And I know a lot of people are saying, when are you gonna be exploring more of Turkey and stuff like that? With all the packages arriving and all the things needed to be sorted out, we're kind of inside Alania right now, but Evelina will have to fly back to Russia for like two days to get the rest of her stuff. And then she will fly back straight away. And once she actually flies back, we're gonna start exploring. But in the meanwhile, we're gonna be doing the daily vlogs like we used to. So I'm gonna be showing you my life, my days, and uh, maybe you got some questions that you wanna ask me. And I'm actually gonna answer one of the questions right now. So one of the questions asked is, how long do I plan to stay in Turkey? Now, to be honest with you, I have no idea what's gonna happen tomorrow. So in the meanwhile, it's probably gonna be no less than a year and if i get my residency permit if i don't get a residency permit in turkey that's gonna suck because i would have to leave this country and if i do have to leave you know the the easiest place to go to after turkey is probably georgia and from there we will decide what we are going to be doing so that is the plan for that a lot of people were asking me about applying on the asylum to the states or to Canada and stuff like that. It's not as actually as easy as you think. To actually apply to an asylum, you actually have to have some sort of a case that you're maybe in danger of your life. You know, somebody's chasing you down, the government is chasing you down. I don't think that the government is chasing me down or that I'm in any danger in Turkey right now. Obviously, I want to move to the States. Maybe I want to check it out, but uh, applying for asylum, they would just reject it straight away. And if they reject it once, it would be very hard for me to actually get into the States, even if I get a visa, you know? But as, ma as many of you might know, I actually applied for the green card lottery. And if I win that, obviously, I'm gonna go visit the United States and we're gonna see how cool it is. So hold your fingers crossed, guys. If I get over to the States, we're gonna be having a lot of fun for sure. I'm not hungry at all, whatsoever. Evelina got hungry. So, if you wanna keep your woman happy, you gotta keep her fed. So, we're going to my favorite kebab place. I actually don't know if I'll actually eat something, but it's called Kebabchi Salal. Check this out, boys. This is the place. Anyways, time to eat. Merhaba. Merhaba. Um, one kebab, one Coca-Cola. One kebab, this one? Yes, yes. Uh, one Coca-Cola. Yes. And uh, can I get a Turkish coffee, please? With sugar. Yeah, thank you very much, my friend. Anyways, all set up. I don't know what I will want, but I'm not hungry at all, so... Yeah, I don't know. But this place is awesome, for a fact. I mean, first of all, it's in a great location. Second of all, the kebabs are absolutely delicious here. Somebody said I should go to the gym, hit the gym, but I commented in the comment that I'll hit a big, fat, sloppy kebab, and then I might think about hitting the gym. So when you order something in this place, you actually get some stuff for free. So this is what you get for free. You get a salad, you get some lemon, some whatever the heck this is. You get a tomato, nice, type of sauce you get a yogurt with mint or something like that and you get some peppers i got myself a turkish coffee because i'm not hungry at all 
So um, I'm gonna be enjoying myself this big cup of Turkish coffee. Mm. Very nice, my friends, very nice. Nothing better than some Turkish coffee in the evening. So Evelina got herself a kebab. This is how it looks like. And now she's gonna have a try of it. So she said it's tasty as usual, so that's good. Anyways, I'm not hungry. I'm just having my Turkish coffee, boys. Cheers. Oh, so we came over to a place where my friend lives to an apart hotel and uh, see what's up with him. How are you? Good? <laughs> so guys, my friend got himself a GoPro 11. Let me check it out. Damn, look at this boys. He's minted. He got the GoPro 11. Damn, look at this. You could see me inside of this little screen right here. Damn. What is the difference? I wonder. Let's check it out. So the news are I finally got hungry. It's raining in Alanya right now. And I came to a sushi place, which is owned by Russians. That's uh, interesting. It's called Sushi Market. I've actually ate there yesterday, but I didn't show it to you guys. But the place is flipping awesome here. Well, didn't have sushi because everybody got cold. Anyways, we're gonna find another place where it's warm. And they want to smoke some shisha as well, so... Whatever, whatever, mate. This sucks. I wanted some good old sushi. But I guess it is not time for it yet. So instead of food, my friends bring me to a store that looks like a flipping awesome place. Let's see what he has here. Damn, look at this cat. Look at this cat chilling out. Damn, look at this. This store looks flipping amazing though. Let's check it out. Let's see. Damn, look, it actually looks cooler than original stores. Look at this. Has all the stuff you need. You need shoes. You got shoes. You need a bag, you got a bag. <laughs> look at the amount of weird shoes. I'm not a shoe guy, I have no idea, but look at this. This is very light. Right. All of this right here. <laughs> okay. This is funny. <laughs> what even is this? I have no idea. 2,700 liters. Maybe it's good, maybe it's not. You never know. Now, if you're a real man, you gotta wear some real shoes. This is what you gotta wear. Check this out. If you're a real businessman, and you have to wear socks with this as well, like really ripped socks. Damn, look at this. Nice. And you got a multiple selection of stuff. So my friend was uh, getting uh, some shoes and he got stuck in it. <laughs> well, I guess he'll have to buy those shoes now. We got a whole concilium of people trying to help him. This is a rescue of a young man right here. I'm now wearing a chicken cap. I actually never can find myself a perfect cap. I don't know. I look weird in them. Look at this. I look so weird. I don't know. This doesn't look good on me at all. What the heck? Maybe it actually doesn't look that bad. I don't know. Tell me in the comment section below if this actually suits me. Because I actually want to start wearing caps. I don't know. Guys, I'll show you a 101 on how to become a gangster. Now you're a flipping gangster. Look at this. Look at this, boys. This is why I don't wear hats or caps. Because I look like a knob end. Like literally, like a full-on knob end. Give me your phone. I don't know. Caps don't suit me for some reason. God dang it. I always wanted a cap. Who has the same problem? Write it down in the comment section below because I think I'm the only one in the world that caps don't fit me. So finally, after all of that walking around the place, we came to a place called Local. This is the place right here. Oh, finally some food. Oh, this place is fancy. I got myself a Philly cheesesteak because Philly cheesesteak is the real man's food. And we got a flipping DJ right there doing the DJ stuff. We got Evelina here. We got all the boys. The crew is here and uh, it's gonna be flipping awesome, boys. Can't wait for my Philly cheesesteak because I only had breakfast today. Oh my God, guys, I got myself a humongous Philly cheesesteak. Look at the amount of cheese right there. You got the fries. Mm. 
Perfect. I'm gonna put some hot Tabasco here. And enjoy the meal. I'm not gonna record this because this thing is way too big to consume. Actually, you know what? I'll take a bite out of it. Damn, let's take a bite out of this. Mm. This is some good stuff. Guys, you can't even know how excited I am right now because for once I get to the apartment door, there should be a delivery for me and the cats. I'm excited for my delivery. The cat's delivery should be their drinking things. So let's see if I got all that. So we have to have two packages by the door and hopefully nobody stole them. Okay guys, your bets are do we have the two packages by the door or not? Okay, let's see. Yes. Got my cat tried to escape. Oh my god, I'm so excited for my package. I could see the box right there. That's my microphone stand. Oh yes. Microphone stand. This is exactly what is needed right here. And this is the stuff for the cats. Guys, Evelina just opened the package and check what they, they gave a little gift. It's fresh meat, carny, cranberry, grain. This is interesting. Wow, this is cool. So guys, I ran into a little problem. Look at this. This is a microphone holder. <laughs> the microphone is way too big. Thank God it had a little adapter right here. And hopefully it will fit the fitting that I have, the original one right here. So let's see. Oh, look how smooth that fits. They thought about everything here. Okay, awesome. Oh my god guys, you can't imagine how happy I am now, I feel like a professional. The only thing that the pop filter doesn't fit in, because the thing doesn't fit in this small, tiny uh, adapter type of thing, but who cares? I got it set up like this, look at this. Damn, and you could see a few people like Gene, Paul, Jose and everybody chatting around the place. Check this out, damn. We got all the crew chatting on, so now I could be a professional streamer. Damn, that's awesome guys. See you on the stream and if you enjoyed this video, please leave a like, subscribe and comment in the comment section below. See you later guys.